All right, today is another day. Um, we are doing another upgrade on my Q50 Red Sport. Um, so I have the heat exchanger right here from the Z1 Mother Sports and then the AMS um, coolant expansion tank. So this two uh, piece will go in the car today. I'll go to shop and then we'll install it at the shop. Um, so yeah, so the reason I'm um, doing these parts this upgrade for this car in like couple weeks, two or three weeks, um, we'll start gaining more power. Um, I have like catwalk exhaust system and then the AMS um, full down pipes with the cats in it because uh, since Maryland is a emission state, you guys have to go get an emission like every two years. So you have to get your down pipes with the cats. If you just put like catless down pipes, you basically will fail on the emission and then it will be a huge problem in the future so yeah we'll go ahead and put these parts the reason i am doing this upgrade um, because of the power uh, once you gain more power i'm 100 percent sure that engine will start getting warmer too so we have to have have that like coolant power better so that's why we are doing this upgrade i also have brakes um, we are going to go ahead and install them too just not in this video it's going to be in the next video and I have the uh, ceramic street brakes, um, sprinkled rollers, like two-piece rollers, and then the, like really, really nice brake fluid. So once we gain more power, of course, we are gonna get faster too. Um, we need to, you know, make the car stop better too. So that's why I got the brakes too. Yeah, um, so stay tuned. I'll see you all at the shop. Um, let's do this upgrade too. I think this car will turn out really, really good. This, this is just like my point is building a ultimate daily driver, and then hopefully we are gonna go ahead and get the second car, and then we we are just gonna go um, crazier with that second car. It's probably gonna be a two-door rear-wheel drive, and then about like 500 horsepower-ish car. So we'll see. All right, guys, stay tuned. I'll see you all at the shop.
right, so now we take one of the tanks off. Um, it was a little bit challenging. I mean, this stuff is already time consuming. It takes a little while, but at the end, it's definitely gonna worth it. Steve is right now taking the other one off. Um, and then when we took the little tank off, we just realized that there's a, what was that, Steve, antifreeze leak? Yeah, antifreeze leak down Yeah, so it, yeah, so now we're gonna go ahead and install the AMS Alpha, this new one, so it, Definitely, it's gonna fix the issue too. All right, so we got the uh, MS Alpha coolant expansion tank in. I'm just like putting everything ba back right now, all the hoses. Yes, sir. It looks way better than the OEM one, huh? So now we are adding more coolant um, because bigger you go, um, more fluid you need. So this is the case right now. Alpha um, coolant expansion tank is way bigger than the OEM one. And also the heat exchanger is way bigger than the OEM one. So that means they will take more fluid. Um, I just went to get a fluid from Nissan dealership, which is right across the street. I mean, the Infinite and Nissan, they use the same. Um, that blue coolant, so we are adding more coolant right now. All right, so we got the coolant fluid down. Um, the car is ready to go. Steve is just gonna go ahead and install the bottom piece and then the side trims and then the front trim, duck lip, and then we'll turn the car on and we'll see how it is. I'm pretty sure it will be good to go. This is the final look of the Alpha AMS an expansion tank and then the final look of the Z1 Mother Sports heat exchanger. All right guys we are done here Steve is just putting the last pieces together and shout out to Steve he did a great job today really good job Steve. All right I'm gonna go ahead and turn the car on let's see Everything works perfectly fine. We are done with the car. Um, today we did the Z1 Motorsport heat exchanger and then the AMS um, coolant expansion tank. Um, it worked, everything works fine. And then the car is right here, running right now. We're just checking the heat, make sure the circulation is, everything is working. Yeah, it took a while, but at the end, the result is always worth it. Um, I can't wait to be done with this car. I think when we're done with this car, it's just gonna be like ultimate daily driver. I'm just gonna give you a little reminder. Um, as long as you guys believe in yourself, and work hard for it, there's nothing you guys can't do. Peace out.